on a wing and a prayer. Now, those of you that know me well, you know that I ride a motorcycle and I ride a gold wing. I often say when I get on it, on a wing and a prayer. And I ride long distances. Now, <laughs> I used to ride a Harley, but in Texas, the engine heat coming up with the extreme temperature outside, literally, I thought some days I would cremate myself. So I got a gold wing, and Harley drivers don't think that's as cool, but that's exactly why I got a gold wing. It's cooler to ride on long distance. 2 Corinthians 13 verse 11 says, Be cheerful, keep things in good repair. Keep your spirits up, think in harmony, be agreeable, do all that, and the God of love and peace will be with you wherever you go. We should never underestimate the power that we have in us in a given moment. The power of a kind word, a sincere smile, a pat on the back, or a heartfelt hug. And we must never underestimate the power and the importance of cheerfulness. The Bible teaches us that a cheerful heart is like medicine, and the people around us feel better. And we are givers of that medicine when we're cheerful. But where, where does the cheerfulness begin? It begins on the inside, when we're feeling good, like when I'm on my gold wing motorcycle and I run into someone or I stop at a restaurant. It is in our hearts, our thoughts, our prayers, and it works its way out from center to circumference. The world would like you to think that material possessions alone bring happiness, but don't believe it. Not even a motorcycle in the end can bring me happiness. I have to bring it to whatever I'm doing, and so do you. Lasting happiness cannot be bought. It's the result of a diligent effort in the disciplines of what we teach, positive thought, heartfelt prayer, and good deeds. But a cheerful heart blessed by God and peace is well worth the effort, and it will come to you each and every time. Thomas Carlyle said, Wondrous is the strength of cheerfulness. And I pray today, on this Friday, that you have that kind of strength in you, and that you give it to others freely. God bless you.